Hey guys, as some of you may have noticed, I have been using this deck for my latest videos, and I realized, I think you guys should know which one I like better, because, I mean, they're both amazing decks, the, Ar the Black Arcane and the, just a normal blue bicycle, so this isn't that normal, it, sorry, it has jumbo letters, but it's still normal, just with di different numbers. Um, so, I got this idea, I call it, well, no, I didn't, I don't, I didn't make it, though. I got this idea from the Cardist, Cardists, T-H-E-C-A-R-D-I-S-T-S, -E -S -S. he's an amazing magician with good reviews, or, I love his videos, they just somehow just bring me in, even though they're just reviews, I just love him, check him out, uh, this, these are called Card Wars, uh, this is the thing I think he made up, um, so, the war, it's not like actually like fighting or anything, you're just saying like the feeling and all that stuff. Well, so, I'm gonna start with the pros for each. This deck handles really nicely, it's low cost, very cheap, uh, easy to see, but that's not, I can't really say stuff about that because, uh, not all the decks are jumbo. Sorry. Um, it's amazing. It's a really good deck. You can spread it nice. Um, it shuffles really, really well. <laughs> yeah. If you want to check out how to shuffle, just uh, on my other video. I'm not that advanced with YouTube, so um, I can't really put it in the link or anything, but... But yeah, I'm saving up for a new camera, so watch. And the reason I have ads is because I want to make money. Sorry about those ads, though. So yeah, this is a really nice deck. Really low cost. Fans well. Really, it's just really good. Uh, now to this deck. It's amazing. I love this. This, like, the, how it like, stands out. And let me get to a face card. Face card. Look at that. Isn't that cool? And the back design, oh my god, look at that. And it's a custom ace. Uh, the, the pips aren't really custom, but the ace of spades, hold on, let me find it. Did I pass it? Sorry. Yeah. Here, sorry. It is amazing. It is really custom. It's nice. Um... The box is really good, but my box is downstairs. And the cool thing is with this, it comes with the joke. Look at those jokers. It says three hearts. That's in the... No, this is my illusion card it comes with. Um, this is joker. It's got to, and it comes with a double backer for certain magic tricks. Or if you want to make like it look like an invisible deck or something. Uh, you know. All right. Also, um, now to the cons of each. The problem with this is that it can be a little stiff and slippery. So, like, sometimes when I'm shuffling or something, and I go like that, it, like, just pops up like that. Okay? But there's a big problem with this. The cardstock is too thin. So, when you shuffle... Okay, so you see all the decks pretty straight, right? I mean, not that straight, but pretty straight. When you shuffle, watch. And then when you go like that, it gets bent, okay? It gets bent. It's too thin. But I think there's a tie, actually, because I really like them both. I think I use them both, but... The most useful for me is probably that deck. I couldn't really think of anything bad. And even though that is a cool design, I usually use this more. Uh, back, I'm going to be back to you with another review of a card deck soon. It's going to be the mini decks. And if any anything, if you know anyone who would like to sponsor me so I could actually get decks to do reviews, I'd like that. But pro no one really would. But, um, thanks for watching, um, subscribe, and we'll start doing giveaways.